have a new fuel filter. It's two banjo bolts and a nut, one Torx that holds this clamp on. It's, it's all a little rusty. So for this rusty Torx, what I did was use a wire brush like that. Wire brush the head of the bolt, put the Torx bit in and hit it with a hammer, made sure I was in and it came out. I have a socket that I hammered onto the banjo bolt while holding fuel filter. Now I'm gonna hold the fuel filter still with this wrench while I break the banjo bolt. Uh, I have this underneath to catch any of the gas that comes out. I didn't bleed any pressure up top. Some people recommend I'm not. One recommendation I have is use a rag around the banjo bolt when it loosens. And then once it's loose and there's no pressure spraying out, you can uh, just drain the filter. Make sure none of the washers stuck to the banjo bolt. These washers have the rubber o-ring in the middle. Both of them came off because you don't want to stack up two washers on one side. It'll probably leak like most things. Don't double wrap it. So it'll fit like this, the small banjo bolt, passenger side, clamp facing this way with the big banjo bolt on the driver's side. All right, new fuel filter is installed. I recommend turning the key to the on position, not turning it on on for three times. Like turn it on, off, on, off. Then try and start the engine. So this is empty. You lost pressure, you need to get the fuel back. So I have the pump, just pump it for a second. All right, gonna replace the tab filter under here. Take off the egg arms and the cowl and there's a protective cowl on there and then the air filter is in there. Here's my new one. Ah, oh, it didn't work. Let's try again. Nope. Get like a little pick or screwdriver and you just pop, pop it out. Same goes for this side. You might want to pull the hose off for the washer fluid. And take that out. Take off the 13s that hold the wipers on. Keep an idea of where the wiper arms are. The 9.5s are usually pretty tough to get off. Even with the tool that grabs around the bottom of the wiper arm and pushes on the stud, sometimes they're tough. Sometimes if you put your fingers under here, you don't want to hit this into the glass. You know? I don't know, I'm used to just putting my hand here and wiggle. And then they come off. I did just install wiper blades on this car along with my winterization of this car. I put a new battery, new wiper blades. I'm getting the new brakes for the rear soon. Just did the fronts, brakes. Did an oil change. This car is getting the whole makeover. It's usually pretty easy. Just pull this off. Pull this up out of the way. I don't want to get to the other side here. And free it up. This one, it goes in the body there drains to water to the bottom. And I just 
pull that out. Oh boy, I'm glad I'm doing cabin air filter. It's dirty, but that's disgusting. Cleaner. It's like a dollar store uh, evergreen or whatever it is. Cleaner. Emergency car outside. This you pretty much just pop out and pop the new one in and then reinstall everything and you're good. So uh, one thing to mention is there's a little tab, like a little circular C tab on the filter and there's a gasket in here and you can see that the little circular thing can fit right here on the opposite of this there's a circular tab here. It'll go on the opposite side of this. You bend it, it'll fold in, it'll sit on top of there. I believe that's how that goes. It clips in on the sides. You pull it up to release it, come out. These tabs like pull up on the ends of the filter. Now I'm gonna put it back together. Okay, one last tip is this top like uh, cowl cover goes under this trim on the window. It's easy to put, once you get it in the, before I forget, this little cover came out. I'm gonna have to put that in in a second. Get it in in the corners, out from under the uh, hood. Put this under and put it in the, the split of the uh, windshield trim. Then sit this down as you push it. Push it in like this, and then these clips will hold it down. And then you could put this trim just right back over top of it. It's, pretty, it's a pretty easy job. It's hard to do everything with one hand though. Not, some things are easy, but.